What is going on, people? It's Elijah from my chargeback. Before I get started, please don't forget to click like and subscribe. And if you've been the victim of a scam, there is a link below in the description to speak to us. Now, I want to get something off my chest today, and it's very, very important. All right. If you have been a scam victim, I want you to listen to me very, very carefully. Stop trying to work it out with the scammer. They are not going to give you anything. I'm so, so sick of you people coming to me and saying, oh, no, I'm trying to work it out with this broker, this broker, this broker. You're not working it out with anybody. They're a scammer. The only thing they're doing is dragging out the scam for longer and seeing how much more they can take from you. Now, yes, it is true that in rare, extremely rare instances, there is a talented enough scammer to say, you know what, I'm going to give you a little. And that's only if you're big, big, big value. You know, if they think they can get 100K plus out of you, maybe. Maybe they'll do that. But 99.99999% of the time, no. And you know what? The only person that you hurt when you do this is you. Do you know why? Because the time that you need to be spending pursuing these people while the money is still in the blockchain is being wasted as they execute this scam before they move on to the next. And not only that, and I'll tell you, this is what really gets me. This is the point where you, the victim, have figured out that it's a scam, but you're not willing to pull yourself out of the cycle. And you're not willing to be 100% honest with yourself. What do I mean here? Okay, you get it. They're asking for all sorts of absurd things. They're making all sorts of absurd claims. And there's a million red lights going off in your head and saying, uh-oh. But you don't want to look in the mirror. And you don't want to face the fact that you were taken as a scam victim. It's tough. Yeah, I get it. There's a few of you that are looking at me like, you know what, fat guy? It's really embarrassing and humiliating. Shut up. Listen to me. Of course it's a little bit that way, but you know what? You're not the only scam victim they took. All right? They took 100 people. Maybe 100,000. There was a bus just now in Europe. The scam span five countries, 89 million euros. All right, 15 call centers. That's a multinational business. They are not going after one person. You by yourself are not worth it. You are one of many people to fall for a well-coordinated sales pitch in a well-oiled machine. So, no. In that respect, you should not feel that way at all. But you do owe it to yourself to pull yourself out of that cycle. Because you're not going to be able to fight back until you've been able to look yourself in the mirror and say, you know what, I got taken, now I have clarity, and now I'm ready and willing to do what it takes. So, this is where I'm going to throw the question back to you. Are you going to continue to lie to yourself and say, you know what, maybe I'll work it out with the broker. Oh, he said, if I pay this, there are no capital gains taxes paid to brokers. It's all on your income taxes. All these absurd fees they make up and all this not table. You got to re-up your capital. All of the convoluted nonsense that they tell you is a lie. Stop it. At this point, you know it's a scam. If you don't, then shame on you. So, are you ready to pull yourself out of the cycle? Are you ready to be willing to be honest with yourself? Are you ready to fight back? I'm going to leave that one up to you. For those that are, for those that want to get after them while they're in the blockchain, while the money is still going through bank accounts, whatever, all right? When the money is hot and it's the best time to strike and fight back, you can talk to us. There's a link below in the description to speak to us. If not, I don't know what to tell you. In any event, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Please check out our other videos. And don't forget to click like and subscribe. I've been Elijah. We'll see you next time.